Greetings everyone, and today I'd like to continue my random talk about the random stuff. The reason why I'm not showing my face is that uh, today I had, you know, not so <laughs> successful <laughs> hairstyle. And my, mm, you know, my hair looks like a crap. So mm, let's talk about the Wheel of Dharma. I'm having a carpet with, you know, Wheel of Dharma where I can stand. Mm, of course, it's not exactly the wheel of Dharma, quite close. And uh, uh, in the middle of the wheel of Dharma, there is a tree staff. It's going to be, you know, Buddha's trinity, uh, his teachings, his followers, and himself. So, in the, you know, you know these are, there's, there's 16 balls around this wheel of Dharma. And uh, you must know that number 16 symbolizes something in Buddhism. So what does it symbolize? I'm going to use, you know, this Tibetan and Mongolian Buddhist Bible, and um, in the page 185, there's this, uh, there's this stuff. In Aron Zorgan Taman Tetir and Ting. So um, this 16 hells. So number 16 is related with, you know, hell. So um, this middle must be a good place, and but these balls are going to be a uh, bad place or these 16 are going to be hell so uh, why there's you know this 16 hell it is because you know there's a eight hot hell and eight uh, uh, you know this cold hell and total you have uh, exactly 16 hell uh, but uh, Buddhism also talks about the random hell also you know extra hells so um, uh, second thing that I would like to talk about is that I totally forgot to you know mention one stuff. I mean, uh, in my previous videos, you will know that uh, from ancient times, Chinese are calling Mongolians as um, Ho, meaning uh, monkey or tiger, something like that. And uh, I totally forgot to mention the you know how Mongolians call you know this uh, a baby of a monkey. This is going to be you know this. Uh, uh, a magazine uh, for for my daughter, and um, uh, here you can you know this uh, read the names of you know these these creatures. For example, uh, piglet is called Tore, and uh, puppy is called Guluk, and you know kitten is called Manjuha, and um, a baby of a monkey is called Monsh. Also, the baby of a monkey is called Monit. So somehow you know monkey uh, or you know this mong is related with the monkey so um, the, uh, the third thing I would like to talk about is that uh, uh, it seems you are celebrating something you know this in this April and you know that uh, Buddhists uh, sometimes celebrate the birth of a Buddha uh, um, where I was um, uh, the birth of a Buddha in April and the the fourth month is going to be, uh, you know, month of a bunny. So number four, you have a bunny. And in my previous videos, you will know that you know bunny is something that is related with you know, the hostess and you know with the sex and etc. etc. And uh, in Mongolian, you know, this uh, idea about you know Western versus in Eastern zodiac, uh, we think that you know bunny is related with the fish. So Chinese will have you know different idea because they think that you know a mouse is related with you know this water bearer etc etc. So um, so uh, you people are celebrating Easter and you know this Easter bunny etc etc. And uh, this Easter thing is going to be you know this something that is related you know this Jesus' uh, resurrection or. Is is Torah something like that? So you know that the fish is uh, some is the symbol of a uh, Jesus. So somehow you know this um, uh, this bunny is related with the fish here in Mongolia. So um, I guess it's uh, always good to have you know own ideas about this world we live in. Well, that's pretty much for today, and thanks for watching.